Hey guys, dude, sick couch here. Welcome back to Evil Within 2. Guys, let's talk to Mr. Mobius here. I think his name is Julian Sykes. I think that's what I recall his name being from the board. All right, I'm all ears. How can we help each other? I need you to restore the server inside the mirror. It should be easy enough as long as none of those freaks are around. Here's where it's located. Ugh, okay. Hold on, I haven't agreed to anything yet. What's in it for me? You do that for me, I can open up all the locked supply caches for you. Oh. And what's in it for you? If you get the server on, I may be able to find another way out of Union. That is an interesting proposal. I like this. There's really a way to get out of Union? I'm not 100% sure, but I'm sure as hell gonna give it a try. They've lost contact with STEM. We're totally cut off. If we don't find the core, we're all gonna die in here. Unless I can figure a way out. How is that possible? You really want me to waste your time talking a bunch of technical gibberish? Sort of. <laughs> so it sounds like he's not super interested in finding the core. He'd rather just leave her alone to die in here and get everybody else out. I'm not sure I'm down with that. All I have to do is turn it on. How did the server go offline in the first place? All I'm saying is if you turn on that server, I can give it a shot. Look at this place. It's breaking apart out there. I'm surprised anything is working. But then again, Mobius probably turned it off themselves. They've got all kinds of emergency protocols in place. And you're questioning the almighty Mobius? Hey, I don't mind being a grunt. But the moment I become expendable, well, that's when I start to look for the exit door. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. So, you gonna help me out or not? Yes, I believe I am. Mission start getting back online because... I would very much like to have these things unlocked. Look, there's even one in here, too. <laughs> Those you know, are locked, but I could get it open if you're willing to help. Yeah, but you know, buddy, if I had these things opened right now and got access to the stuff that was in them, that would be a major, major help in getting me to unlock or turn back on the server or whatever the hell you want me to do. Because as it is, it's going to be difficult, man. There's a lot of shit going on out there. I don't know if you've noticed. <laughs> uh, so we have to fight all the way back there. It's really not that far. But we're probably going to have to take on Buzzsaw Bitch. Because she's waiting for us out there, guys. Alright, that guy just has handgun bullets. That's not a huge deal. Uh, well, we might as well get to it, guys. This is obviously a thing that we're going to do. I'm not sure if I need to go back to my room. Um, I should maybe just do some crafting back there real quick. I've used up a lot of bolts, I think. Well, actually, maybe not, because I think <laughs> the battles where I used up all my bolts on Buzzsaw Bitch are the ones that I died on, so maybe I still do have a fair amount. Let's look. I've got three harpoons. I'm going to... I'm going to make... Hmm, I'm going to make two more. I'm pretty sure I'm going to want them. we got five explosive. Yeah, we're, we're pretty good on most things, actually. Okay. Yeah. I guess that was worth the trip. <laughs> sort of. It'll be worth it if I can actually kill that bitch. Get her off my nuts for two seconds. I really should be using the shotgun more. Oh, I wonder if I should pour some upgrades into the shotgun. I used a lot of my weapons parts. I probably can't even do that right now. Honestly. Okay. Julian, you wait here, I guess. I'm gonna venture back outside. Where all the horribleness is happening. What? What was that? I just paused for a second and heard some kind of mechanical noise out here. Oh, I don't like this, guys. I think they're back in this area. Those are the bullets I had to leave behind. Yeah, this is gonna happen, guys. There's no avoiding this. We might as well just come out and face the music. What? I think that's that thing making that noise. <laughs> He's just like growling ominously over all the land. 
What is this dude? I had to run past this dude before. Okay, that's probably the handgun bullets that I picked up inside the safe house, so... There she is, guys! There she is. She is definitely going to dog us every step of the way. There's just no getting around it. I really, really wish I could do some kind of stealth attack on her. Uh, maybe I can look around and find some traps. I know there are barrels hanging around. There's at least one still in there. Uh, getting her in there is probably either not possible or extremely difficult. Can I hit her with the axe? I don't know if melee attacks work on her. She sounds so angry all the time. <laughs> well, maybe not angry, but she sounds very sadistic. Just ready. Ready for murder. I don't even know how to start taking her on, guys. What is that stuff right there? I mean, I guess I could just pour harpoon bolts into her. I can't believe she doesn't detect me right now. What the fuck? Oh my god! <laughs> Right. Give me this stuff. What happened to you? You looked like you were trying to escape. And you just didn't quite make it! Okay! <laughs> Here we go, guys! I did see a barrel back in that direction. Ugh! I'm trying to make absolutely certain I land these harpoon bolt shots because it's so easy to miss with them, it seems. Here we go, here we go. Come on, bitch. Yeah! That was a good shot. Whoa! Need to make sure I manage my stamina. Which is very tricky, guys. It's very tricky. Can I find more traps? Oh, it's coming back so slowly. Oh my god, oh my god! Need more barrels! Oh! Oh! Yep. Did not see that little partition right there. <laughs> okay, I think I landed all of those shots, guys. Ooh. Did that stun her? I feel like that stunned her for a second. Ugh. This is a dangerous game I'm playing, guys. Ugh. 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 Yep. Oh no! No! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Let me move! Oh, I don't know how I didn't die there, guys. I don't know how. Okay, my stamina's back. Let's get some distance. Heal again. Here we go, here we go. Oh, <laughs> Please die! Please die! Did she die? I got her! I got her, guys. <laughs> I like how she cries a little at the end there. Like, she keeps laughing, but she, like, laugh cries when you kill her. It's creepy. Ugh. I did it! Yay! Alright, let me come back and grab this uh, ammo that I left behind. I guess I could have let her right in here, honestly. Oh well, maybe next time. Sweet! Is that all those? Yeah, okay. So now we can relax a little bit. Sucks that I had to use two of my syringes, but you know what? Honestly, I've got so many herbs, it really doesn't matter. If I can just hightail it back to the save point, I'll craft a couple more and it'll be fine. It was worth the expenditure, 
I dare say. So I'm just going to meander back this way and keep an eye out for more enemies. Look for more things along the way. What's in here? Nice. Got a lot of enemies that way, so uh, I'll come over here. Look at this. Hey, I found stuff. Awesome. Hey, is that a full med kit? Oh, awesome, guys. I've been looking for one of these for quite a while. Finally found one. Perfect. And right when I needed it, too. <laughs> That'll certainly come in handy, most likely. Alright. What's around this area? Yeah, I found that one before. Sniper rifle ammo pouch. Oh, hell yeah. And it's close. Okay, guys. Let me pop over this direction. Should be right here? This one? No, that guy doesn't have anything. Hold on, let me consult the map. It is right there. It's very close to me. Ah, up on there. Okay. Um... There's a lot of enemies near me, and a statue. Check it out. Nice. I haven't actually stopped to take note if I've gotten, like, an, an autosave recently. I really hope it would save my victory against Sawblade, bitch. <laughs> but I don't know. Where? Oh, it's one of those crawling things. Oh, shit! No! Why? I do not want to fight one of those things right now. Did I lose them already? Where'd he go? Where'd he go, guys? There he is, there he is! Damn it! They've got good vision. They've got really good vision. Oh, can he come in here? No. I'm gonna try to sneak away though. Fuck. I think I made it. I think I'm clear. <laughs> I haven't had to face one of those things in so long. I just. I feel very ill prepared for it. Very much so, guys. Okay, what spot is this? Where am I? This is not the main story resonance, but a resonance all the same, so maybe we'll go in and check it out. I don't know. Nice. We can now carry 11 sniper shots, and then those are actually some decent upgrades. The next two we find. Fuck. He sees me again. Can he get me from where he is? Don't know. Is he smart enough to come around the long way? <laughs> nah. Nah, he lost me. He's not a threat. He seems to kind of stick to that area, so as long as I just don't hang around there, I'll probably be okay. <laughs> Nothing in there. Alright, let's pop in here, I guess. This is probably going to be more than I am bargaining for. But I want to investigate anyway, because that's how I get down, guys. Um, let's see. That palm tree looks weird. Ah, there's the point. Okay. Give me one second. Let's look through the rest of these rooms. Oh, this is an exit. All right. <laughs> Really should be using my shotgun in here. Oh, 
Syringe? Nice! <laughs> I'm almost full on healing again, guys. Almost. What was that? I saw a prompt pop up for half a second. I don't know what it was. Let's see what this place has to offer, guys. Let's check out the menu here. This is actually difficult to read. Grilled something. Tuna melt. Chicken wrap. Chef's grill. Steak sub. Mmm. That sounds delicious. The most expensive item on the menu. Why wouldn't it be? Steak is awesome. High quality steak, anyway. Okay. Oh, that is a super dead guy. <laughs> Wait, there was something to pick up there? Yeah. And I'm full on handgun bullets, nice. So that's what happened to this guy. Well, I respect your choice, even if I don't agree with it, sir. This place is pretty hellacious, but you know what? It's all about fighting to the end. Ride or die, motherfucker. What? Ah! I was just kidding. I'm about to kill myself, too. <laughs> it's a haunted jukebox. Ah! Oh, fuck, no! Please, no! Oh, God. Where am I supposed to go? Where do I go? How do I make this not happen, guys? Oh, my fucking God. Oh, my God. I intensely dislike this. She knows exactly where the hell I am. Ugh. Okay, okay, now I lost her. I don't know where to go, guys. What's the way out of here? Map? Map data unavailable, of course. Oh, I wish I could kill this bitch. I'm not sure if I've ever actually tried shooting her. Maybe I did once. I don't think I can, though. I think that's not how these sequences are supposed to play out. They're not combat scenarios. You just have to stay stealthy and figure out how the hell to get out of here. Here we go. This looks new. <laughs> this is probably where I was supposed to go right away. She's probably supposed to chase you down this hallway. But I created my own path. Because that is what I do. Is she really not following me down here? Okay. Okay, I don't like this. She's gonna pop in here any second. I have 100% faith in that. Shit! No! No! The, okay, Jesus! It really focused in on that mirror for some reason. What? She went through the mirror. What does that thing want from me? Oh. Oh. Hey, the door's open. Nice. Okay. So she can go through mirrors and walls and doors. She can pretty much go wherever she wants. <laughs> what is this? This looks like an area from the first game. Oh, we've got a bunch of doors in here. So many doors. Okay. Um, we've got a... What the fuck? Oh, this is a puzzle, guys. Okay, what am I... How do I tell which one's right? That's me from back then. Oh, fuck! <laughs> of 
Great. Um, okay. Uh, shit. Okay, so it's... The one in the mirror that was lit up. Uh, I think it was this one? Uh huh. Did I do it right? Is this correct? This looks different. More doors. Shadow of more doors. Oh, shit. No. Oh, no! She's actually in here now. Uh. Uh. I have to get a look at that mirror. Fuck you. You can't just hang out in front of the mirror. I need that. Okay. This is sort of my chance. Um... I think it's this one right here? I think? <laughs> Running now. Uh-oh. Something's wrong. Why is that thing chasing me again? <laughs> Something's wrong. Biggest understatement of the year, Sebastian. What is this? Hey, we got another slide. Awesome. Oh, that's perfect. That makes me want to run back to the safe house right now. <laughs> oh, am I done in here? Did I win? I think I won, guys. I don't rightly know... I guess I did it correctly. I went through the right doors. Um, I don't know what happens if you go through the wrong door. Maybe it plays out differently. I don't know. It seemed correct. The way everything played out there, so. Anyway. Okay, so we've cleared off this. Yeah, it's time to head back here. That's where we need to go. And I'm going to go this way, because I don't want to run into that disgusting, super strong, crawly guy again. That's never a good time. Pretty much never. <laughs> Just trying to be super aware of everything right now, guys. I think I've been through most of this area already anyway. I'm going to need that. Thank you. You know, guys, one minor complaint that I could leverage against this game, and I don't even know if you can really tell just from watching me play, but when you first get access to a thing that you can pick up, much like the gunpowder that I just picked up right there, for some reason, it always takes a while for you to actually be able to pick it up. Like, as soon as you break the window, or the box here, like, I'm mashing the button. I'm just mashing the pickup button. Okay, that time it worked really quickly, but the first time it took, like, a solid three seconds before I could actually pick it up. And I don't know why it's like that. They're burning the bodies. Why? Well, obviously because of tactics, Sebastian. We're trying to keep them from reassembling the bodies into the horrific buzzsaw bitch monster. Didn't really seem to work out. Didn't work out for that guy. Didn't work out for me. <laughs> yeah, we can use that to draw attention over here. I don't know why we would ever want to do that. I did get kind of hopeful for a second the first time I saw that. Is that a fucking... Oh, it's another syringe. Nice. I'm full up. <laughs> uh, the first time I saw the pile of burning bodies, I was like, oh my god, are they going to bring back the burning mechanic? Because that was actually a really big part of the first game. You could burn the bodies that you killed and like other corpses that you find, and it prevented them from like getting back up. Or, like, sometimes you can even catch more than one enemy in it and take out a bunch of enemies that way. And it was, uh, it was a pretty fun mechanic. And they just completely eschewed it for this game. Is that, is that how you say that word? I don't know. I don't like how I can always hear that dude growling. I really don't. It always makes me think I'm about to get attacked. Like, no matter what's going on. Okay, where's the door to get in? Is it this door right here? 
Yeah, we made it, guys. That actually wasn't too bad. Alright, from here... Uh, okay, first things first. Let's have a slushy. Nice, refreshing slushy. Mm-mm. That hits the spot for sure. And then I am going to pop a save. And now I need to find out... Hold on, where do we want to go first? Okay, let's go back first. We have a slide. Maybe we can buy some decent upgrades or something, I don't know. Kitty, I've got more stuff for us to look at together. Are you ready? You should be ready, this is pretty much the only thing you ever do, right? <laughs> This is probably the highlight of your day when I come back here with stuff for you. Hey, hey, and this is the next chronological one. Awesome. So according to these, we're not even halfway through this game yet, which is nuts. But I guess that's how it is. <laughs> oh, it's me all passed out at the bar. It's me, Kidman. Good to know you're still there, Sebastian. After Beacon, I tried to make some sense of what happened to me. But everyone said I was delusional. For hiding the truth. I started to believe that maybe they were right. That maybe I was crazy. I felt so frustrated. Useless. Drinking was the only thing that killed the pain. So much time wasted. I could have tried harder. Shit. Don't beat yourself up, Sebastian. When Mobius doesn't want to be found... Don't make excuses for me, Kidman. I fucked up. Look, Sebastian, this isn't the time to dwell on the past. This is the time to make up for it. Self-pity is what led you to drink in the first place. You have a chance to get back what you lost. Don't lose sight of that. Harsh, but true. You're right, Kidman. Thanks. Eh, you know... I would say the only part where you really fucked up completely was in not trusting your wife. I mean, when she came to you and told you that she had definitive proof that your daughter was alive, I feel like that warranted at least a little look over. Just a little look-see to, you know, be like, oh, maybe she's onto something. I can spare five minutes to try and vet this information with her. <laughs> but man. What can I help you with, detective? I mean, like, in Sebastian's case, it's kind of like, he knew he was right, but it also sounded insane, and everybody was telling him he's insane. Which, to be fair, is probably, like, exactly what going crazy feels like, right? <laughs> it's like, you know that you're right, but everyone else is telling you you're wrong and you're nuts. And there's no good way around that. Like, at some point, you would just start believing that you were nuts too, right? You would have to, to keep yourself actually sane. So, like, I don't know, I can't really blame him for the way he handled all that. Hi, nurse. You seem more at ease, detective. You found a possible ally in this dangerous world. Who are you talking sure about? about that? I never know who to trust in here, present company included. A shame. After all we've been through together, isolation and distrust aren't symptoms of mental illness, but they are unfortunate byproducts of it. Closing yourself off from others does nothing but agitate your condition. You are human. You require connection the way a plant requires light. The only connection I require right now is to your machine. I've still got a long road ahead of me. Alright, I think that was redundant, but eh. Let's see what we can do, guys. We've got 12,000 gel. That is a fair amount. I have no idea what I want to focus on with this. I mean, I really liked the idea of having longer endurance and more stamina, but that doesn't seem to have panned out all that great for me. <laughs> Also, this menu is kind of hard to navigate. It's, it works better with the D-pad. So, we could get the maximum stamina gauge. It's not a huge upgrade. But it would probably help. It's like all my gel, though. I don't know, guys. I don't know if there's a better one I should spend this gel on right now. The recovery speed. Yeah, I think I like that a lot more, actually. Okay, sold. Yeah, that'll... That'll be, like, the gift that keeps on giving, because it'll always come back faster now. Which means we'll be able to run more often. 
And that's really all we can do. <laughs> Alright then. And let's just take a look at our workbench here. We've got 450 parts. Um, crafting, first of all, you're really pretty good on most things. Spent all my harpoon bolts, so I'll go ahead and make like four more of those, I guess. And yeah. Now, as far as upgrades, I think I can. I think I can't afford this next firepower upgrade. Um, yeah, I can. And then the, the last one's 800. Might as well. Well, let me just double check the shotgun firepower upgrade because I'm getting a lot of ammo for this. And if I could like knock this up a couple times, it's probably worth it. Oh, we have the same scenario here where I I should buy one critical upgrade. Just to have the chance to go from 1 to 20% is kind of like buying the skill in the first place. So, yeah. We will grab that. I probably won't bother with this last one because 40% isn't, like, phenomenal. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see as the game goes. And then I'm going to buy this one. And I'm 10 away from this one. Oh, that's bullshit. Oh, well. Those are also very bad incremental upgrades, but, yeah, that's what we have to work with, guys. 